Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. How are you? I hope you're fabulous. Thank you for tuning in to the Daily Dose of Inspiration with Angel Marie, your light worker. If you don't know what a light worker are, you are a light worker because you're here. <laughs> if you want a reading, uh, pretty much do this every morning except for Monday and Tuesdays. I am starting to take the days off, but I might come on anyway because I really enjoy giving these. And what we do is we start out with my deck. This is my personal deck. And we start out with a reading from my personal deck to everyone while we wait for people to come on and people to ask for a reading. Because I would love to give you a little snippet, like an inspiration to go to really kind of look in at your life and go, how does it really work and how am I showing up? So, and I usually always ask for everyone to give me a number from 1 to 52 and then I can give you a message out of my book because it's 52 different secrets. So here's your, your message for today, everybody's message for today, the only goal. Okay, now I don't really like saying goals. For me, it's a promise that I'm making to myself because goals are a lot of times in work, in corporate, I call it corporate hell. And they give you a goal and they, you know, you have to go for it. And then you get there and then they just put another one on and they don't even celebrate sometimes that you made the goal and you've been working so hard for this goal. So I don't always like that one, but that's, that's corporate a lot of times and what they do. So here you go. I will go where I can truly be, where I will fully shine. Oh, <laughs> you know, I like this one. It's just shining it. I will go where I can truly be, where I will fully shine. I act and think according to this ultimate goal, my fulfillment. I let go. I let no one come between my goal and me, nor will any abstract, abstract, obstructural stop me. Ooh, if you want a rating, I have, you have to put yet that you would like a reading and who you are. Say hello, everybody. And I transcend duality and I live fully. So be it. So what I would say to this card, if I was giving you and I, I, I got this card, what I would say is, is when you're truly being who you are and you're fully shining in your beingness, you, you are promising and you are stepping into your fulfillment and your ultimate promise to yourself. No one can get in your way. There's no abstractions. There's no, no things in your way, but yet there isn't any distractions and obstructions because you move right through them like, like they're not even there. You just really fly through them. And it is a duality to have this happen. This is a beautiful card for everyone to look at your day and see what are you doing. Are you still in, in that lockdown? I don't like that word. But yet, are you still there? If you are, what is in your way from not getting that promise that you wanted to clean the junk drawer up today? You wanted to clean the closet out. You wanted to write something or you wanted to start your book so you just sit down and start writing your book what is it that's in your way and is it really you so i want you just to take take a look at that and nikki is on the line yay nikki and nikki is all the way from italy holy moly nikki and i think it's like five o'clock your time right now and nikki is going to be on the show tonight the light workers Lightworkers Unite, if you could write that, Nikki or somebody else, whoever else is, Lightworkers Unite for Healing Circle. You're going to be in the circle tonight, all the way from, from Italy, and most of you know, you know, my last name is Monicelli. I'm, I'm originally from Buffalo, New York, born and raised, first six years of my life, and then I came here to Phoenix, Arizona, thank you, thank you, thank you. And but yet all of my family is out of Italy, outside of Rome, and they're Monticellos or something, because of course they changed our names when we came into town, came here. So I'm gonna give you a reading, Nikki. But Nikki is an amazing lady, does retreats and has an, an awesome online presence in her personal group. And if you want to get involved with that, please, you know, just contact her because she has an awesome group where she's light workers unite. Yep, that's tonight at six o'clock California time, Arizona time, and like two in the morning, two 
<laughs> like three in the morning for Nikki. <laughs> yeah. And she's going to get up that early for you and give us a beautiful chat about what's going on in Italy. And it's pretty sad in Italy right now. But where she's at, she is in a beautiful area. And so beautiful, beautiful. So let's get a card for Nikki Nikki tonight at 6 o'clock. Yep, at 6 o'clock tonight. And it's on this page. So just come back to this page and we'll be there, me and Nikki. Um, Nikki from and living in Italy and me, my ancestors. Okay, so Nikki, 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 here is your card. Here it is right here. Bam! It's upside down. So in yours is truth and integrity. Ooh, this is a really good one. This is for everyone that's watching too. And please, everybody say hello so I can get you a reading. And this this card with truth and integrity is saying that it's, it's a confirmation card, but it's also for you to take a look at what's really going on with you and how do you and how are you showing up? Are you giving too much, honey? Because a lot of times, light workers, we give so much that we don't take care of ourselves. So this one is, is don't take the words literally, truth and integrity, like you don't have any. That's, that's not it. That's not it. It's a very exciting card because your integrity, because I know you, your integrity is so high. But I want you, this is more of taking a look at inside. Are you really, are you really taking care of yourself? Are you taking those walks? Are you taking and having that healthy food? Are you taking care of you or are you taking care of everybody else? That's what that one is taking. And when I see truth, yeah, and you're giving, yeah, because it kind of maybe hits home with you, Nikki, because you're such a nurturer. You're so, good morning, Jody, And you're such a nurturer and a, and a giver that, you know, it might be time for you, Nikki, to take some time to relax and maybe make sure you do your alarm so you meet with me at three in the morning but maybe it's it's time to just lay around a little bit and 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 come from a place of what what is your truth within you and it's not truth or lie that's not it this is an internal truth inside of you jody if you want to readings go ahead and just say yes i don't think i've given you a reading and it might if i did it was days ago so if you want one and jody i'd love to see you at tai chi also this morning at 10 over at the park i'm going to be over there if you can get away. So, Nikki, I hope that is kind of resonates maybe to take a look. And everybody that's on the line in the repeat, in the replay, take a look at, uh, uh, take a look at how you're showing up for yourself internally and how it, it looks like for you that you're putting you first. And, you know, I always talk about, oh, yay, hey, Miss Rain is on the line too. And I'm always talking about, how we show up, but how we are self-centered. <laughs> self-centered. You know why? Because when we're self-centered, that means we're centered on self. You're welcome, Nikki. And, and the integrity is saying the integrity that you say, I'm going to go to bed at 9 o'clock so I can get up at 3 in the morning. And you actually do it and you don't put anybody first. So, Nikki, breathe in that beautiful Italy because you've sent me some some videos of where you live oh my gosh it's fabulous grow it's just so beautiful so aloha or hawa h-o-l-a hi yeah hi miss Raina. so you're welcome nikki i will see you tonight on lightworkers unite for healing circle six o'clock arizona california time all the way from italy i cannot wait you have got to hear her story amazing light worker you've got to hear her story so yay the next one we're gonna move right along and we're gonna move right along to jody jody you still there go ahead and give me a shine on shine on you know what i could not find today uh, Miss Raina, maybe you can do this for me. I could not find what national holiday it is today. Or Nikki, if you have a minute. But Nikki, you need to go to bed so you can get up in the morning. <laughs> you can get up at 3 in the morning, 2 in the morning to be on the show. 
So somebody look up national, you know, national holiday. What national? I could not find it. It wasn't on my email this morning. So Jody, 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 Jody. And Jody, I haven't seen you in so long. Maybe you could make it to the park. That would be great. Oh, give me a heart. Thanks, thanks, thanks. Give me some more hearts. Yay. So lots of love to you, Nikki, too. And um, somebody else, whoever's on the line, give me a number 1 to 52, and we'll give a reading out of that. My, out of my book because, well, because we can. That's how I wrote it. Jody, right there. Children upside down. I don't think you're going to be having any children because I know you. But the children, whenever, you, Jody, this is for you. When you get the children card, the children card is, are you taking more time? Husband Appreciation Day. Oh, okay. Um, are you taking the time to... Um, are you taking the time to see things in a way that is new? Like when you see your day and you see a flower, Jody, everybody on the line, do you see it as, oh my gosh, look how beautiful that is? Or do we just do a lot of times we'll just look at it and move on? The children card is always about that appreciation for the little things in life that we seem to really just walk over or or un, just like move on from and we don't really appreciate now Jody I know you you do your walks you do you do it your morning routine you have that stuff going on so I believe that this card is about and it's upside down so it's about taking a look at more of how are you appreciating yourself and how are you being in awe of yourself and giving yourself for more self-esteem, self-worth, self-confidence? Because you deserve that. And, the, and more of that too is, is staying out of the fear. Because we don't know what's going to happen, but staying in a place. Now, I know you because you're one of my students, my Reiki students. You probably do this really well, but sometimes you flux. And I want you to be okay going up and down. Right? Because going, can I get something from you, Jody, that this is kind of resonating with you? And if it doesn't, it doesn't. You don't, you just put a heart if it doesn't really resonate. Because I don't want you to make something up for that. But that you are stepping into that awe about who you are. Because we need you right now, light worker. We need you, right? And, and we need you to help us and help the, the universe and be out there so that we can connect more because the light workers are needed right now. Nobody wants to go to the hospital. They don't. They won't go to the hospital. They're looking for light workers with energy healing to help. You're needed right now. And it, it doesn't mean you have to do, you know, like sessions like I do and sessions online. But it's also, Jody, for you to step into your vibrational field, which I think you are, but even in a bigger way, in a soul level. So I hope that helps, Jody. Please write something. And um, what I'm getting is it's National Husband Appreciation Day. So appreciate all the husbands out there. I'm going to say all the partners also. So we're just going to appreciate the partners in your life. So National Line, and then it's National Lineman. I don't know really what the lineman is, but okay. I've been doing more of the appreciation, literally stopping and smelling flowers. I'm, so it's a confirmation. That's good. That does help. Oh, good, Jody. So it, it, it confirms with you to take more time in its appreciation. Because remember, like I'm always bringing this up. You know my meter that I always use. And appreciation is above joy. It's above peace and compassion. So we, we have neutral at 250, but we have love at 528, which most people don't know how to love themselves. So joy is at 540, and then peace is 600, and beyond that is appreciation and gratitude. Oh my gosh, when we really step into that appreciation and gratitude, our vibrational field is like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Can I do that again? Whoa, whoa. So... You're welcome, Jody, and I'm so glad to see you. And hopefully, um, it would be great to see you at Tai Chi on a Saturday or every day at 3 o'clock, because I know you live close. Every day at 3 o'clock, you can come over here, be outside. You don't have to be 10 feet from me. And maybe we can hang out, you know, in the patio 10 feet away, and we can hang out for a few minutes and see how things are going. I don't know. So, but let's chat a Runo at least. I like that. Chat a Runo! The Runo! Oh, don't start with the, the pecans and the cockroaches! Remember the cockroaches? 
So happy National Husband Day. Happy National Lineman Day. I think lineman it used to be the... Well, I, don't, I don't really know. So anyway, I was going to make something up, but I don't know. <laughs> so Jody, you got children. Nikki got truth and integrity. And Raina looks like she's up because Raina's the only one. that. Raina, are you still there? And you would like... Someone give me a number from 1 to 52 because I, ooh, Raina, one of the cards fell out for you. It fell out right here. Oh, 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 oh. So what do you think? I don't know which way it went, so I'm just going to do this. Woo! Oh, forgiveness, forgiveness. Now, Raina, you're a light worker. You do this kind of stuff. So I know you have worked many, many years probably on forgiveness for yourself. Yes, she's still there. Forgiveness for yourself and for forgiveness for others. I believe this forgiveness is on a different level. It's on a soul level. And because you do a lot of activations, which it takes, man, that's some internal work there for you. This is a confirmation that you've done your work and that you're clear. That's what I get. I don't get that there's more to forgive. I don't. But for everybody... I want you to look at how much time have you, this is for everyone, how much time have we spent, have you spent in forgiveness for self and forgiveness for others? For many of you, Jody, Nikki, Ray, Miss Raina, that are on the line, those are the only three that I see, even though there's four people on, actually there's more, um, I want you to take a look at how much have you forgiven yourself? And you know what? Miss Raina, you're a wonderful um, light worker in what you're doing to help the world. And you've done your work with forgiveness. And I want you also to step into that soul connection of the forgiveness for the ancestors. This is for everybody. But the ancestors, forgiveness for the ancestors, and also forgiveness for all times and eternity. It's on a deeper level, which you've probably already did. Miss Raina, can I get so, uh, celebrate sessions once a reading? So, oh, Kaba, I can't say his name. Sessions, yeah. Good morning, Jill. Good to see you. Sessions, Mr. Sessions, I'll call him that because Gabriel, Gabriel, I think it's Gabriel. Anyway, you know, you know, I know who he is, but he wants a, he wants one too. Yay! So I hope that helps, Miss Raina. That's just a confirmation for you. You're doing your work, and thank you because everybody out here, Jill, Miss Raina, Nikki, Jody, Mr. Sessions, <laughs> let's go of the forgiveness. Forgive yourself. Forgive Caleb. Oh, Caleb. Okay. No, say Caleb. Yes, yes, yes. So it makes sense to you, Miss Raina. Good. It's a really good confirmation card for you. Yes, it does. It does. Thank you. You're welcome, Miss Raina. One, one through somebody. Jill, give me a number from 1 to 52. Oh, give me the hearts. I love the hearts. Thank you, Miss Raina. And 1 to 52. Give me a number. 1 to 52. Give me a number, Jill. And then that is going to have to be it. Mr. So, let's see. Miss Raina got forgiveness. And Mr. Sessions is next, and he's going to have to be the last one until I get a number from this, and then I'm going to have to go. Oh, thank you, Nikki. Thank you, Nikki, for the hearts, too. I'm very excited about tonight. Very excited to go teach some Tai Chi out at the park today. Number 13, thank you, Jill. You rock. Yay. And Jill, I'll see you at 3 o'clock right here on the same page for some Tai Chi. One of these days you're going to surprise me and show up. Here you go. Study. Study going straight up. Mr. Sessions, whenever I get study for someone, this is on a deeper level. Now, I know Mr. Sessions. He's an amazing video photographer. I can't wait to start working with him because we're going to do some really cool stuff online with the videos and stuff that I'm doing. And getting the study card is about studying, yes, again, you. It's going even deeper into where you're going and how you feel about yourself. Also, now everybody, this is for everybody always, is how much time are you really spending? Are you spending way too much time in front of the computer? I'm really gonna encourage you, Mr. Sessions, that 
Capiel, I want to say your name, but anyway, what I want you to do is Mayo, Mayo Clinic says 45 minutes sitting, 15 minutes standing. 45, 15, please do your, your timer because that is so important for you to get up and move because we don't move enough, so that's one aspect of it. The other one is, is I really encourage everyone to stop listening to meditations. Yes, I have a seven minute meditation to get rid of fear. If anybody wants it, you can, you can message me. So yeah, I, I just said, oh, if you want that, you can have it. But the thing is, is I want you to record, because everybody has a phone. I'm looking for my phone, I'm using it. <laughs> everybody has a phone. Go ahead and record a, re a meditation for yourself. Listen to yourself. Program yourself because it actually activates more when you do that. So I'm just going to invite everyone. Mr. Sessions, great card because study is always about studying self. And there's something that you really want to do and you haven't been doing it. So I really encourage you, whatever that is. And I don't know, Mr. Sessions, is he's on, go ahead and say, you know, that this is resonating. There's something that you want, maybe it's art, maybe it's drawing, maybe it's just you want to go for a hike and you stop yourself because you just are starting to work. You've got to take the breaks more. So I hope that helps you. Taking breaks more will really help and help with your energy. So take more breaks. Everybody take more breaks, especially right now, especially right now. Take more breaks to do the breathing. Take more breaks to go outside, to stand. Stop sitting so long, please. Okay, so that's study. I get study all the way. That is spot on for celibate Mr. Sessions. Good. Okay, good. He sit, I think he's sitting too long. That's what I get. Yeah, he says it does. Okay, cool, Miss Raina. Thank you. Thank you. I hope that does. Because um, we got to take care of our physical third dimensional body. I mean, I'm going to... Very soon, my birthday's next month. Don't tell me. I'm going to be, shh, don't tell anybody. Don't tell anybody. I'm going to be 58. And you know what? I don't feel that way, but yet I know that I need to step into, and I said need, and I don't like that. I know that I get to step into really nurturing me. I mean, I had two friends come over last night. Shh, don't tell anybody. And... And I told them, I said, you can't get here until 7 because that's when I finish my show and then I have to do things and I'm done. And you have to leave at 9.30 because I want to be in bed asleep by 10.30 because I know I'm going to get up at 5 in the morning. So taking care of yourself and looking at what and how you take care of yourself is really important. And that sitting, standing thing. Okay, so Jill. Okay, so. I get so excited. I know I do. And so Jill, Mr. Sessions got study. And then Jill, what we got, what we all, and this is for everyone. And Jill, say you're still here, please, or that you want this. Number 13 out of the Shadow book. I love my book. I do. And it's okay to love your book. It's okay to love your creation. It really is. It makes you, it's okay, is awareness. So awareness, awareness is the electrifying moment that ignites your action. And it is, it's like when you are aware, now you always know I say this all the time, be aware, be responsible, and then take the action. Mindset, heart set, gut set. So this awareness, electrifying moment, because when you're aware of something, when you're aware that you need to do this, when you are in there, you get to do this, because I don't like need, you get to do this, what happens is, is you take action. And it's inspired action, right? It is. So awareness. So getting the awareness card is, Jill, everybody that's on the line, what are you really aware of in your life that's unfolding in your life? How are you showing up? And are you showing up in a way that helps you to be responsible, to, to be able to take that action? So I want you to check, check, and are you aware of that you should not be eating that sugar or that cookie or, you know, the pasta? You're aware of it. Well, what, are you being really responsible for it? Are you stepping into that responsibility of saying no or doing something different where it takes from your action? 
makes sense, doesn't it? Because awareness is so powerful because it's like, uh, there's been a couple of things in my life. One of the biggest ones was actually my taxes. The way that I was doing my taxes, I thought I was doing them right. And then all of a sudden, we sat down and she's like, no, you got to do it in it. And I was like, wait a minute. Why have I been doing it this way? And it's like, oh, I wasn't aware. And there's so many things that we think that other people know, like just breathing. And they don't. They don't realize how important it is. Oh, so it made sense to you. Good, Jill. Good, because that awareness is so powerful. And sooner or later, I'm going to get to see you and your husband spot on. Okay, cool. Spot on. Good, good. So come out and see me at 3 o'clock if you can. I don't know if you're working at home or not, but I think you live pretty close. So we'll chat Aruno on that. So i got to give you the action step out of the book because, well, because I can. So the action step, because it's, the definition and a couple stories to kind of hone it in and then what shine says you want to know what shine says and then I got, I've got to go because I got to go to the park for Tai Chi so speak shine speak and that's why she's on the front shine and it is shine is an Australian cattle dog which is a herding breed she is highly aware of her surroundings she scans as she walks down the street fully and totally aware that's what she feels about aware and it really is she is like on it She's a chicken shit, though. Ooh, shh, don't tell anybody. But she is a chicken shit. There is, like, a bang in that talk. She's like, whoa! And then you can hear, you can hear it when she barks. <laughs> but um, I have seen her get pretty angry when someone's come at me. So she's, she's, she's fierce. She's, she's fierce. But loud noises, they're very, very, very sensitive. Kind of like me. With my being in path and I'm very sensitive, you know. Anyway, so the action step. Take a breath in, everybody, Jill. Everybody, thanks for the one. The, <laughs> lots of loves. <laughs> Good, because this is to inspire you, right? To inspire you to not be so hard on yourself and be that. Lots of love. Thank you, Jill. And thank you, Miss Raina. So the action step. Take a breath in. Mentally put yourself back into a situation or conflict from the day. Write down actions, emotions, dialogue, and body language that you recall. Write down any actions you would change and breathe. What has happened already in your morning that maybe you would want to change a little bit of your actions, your emotions, the dialogue. Think about what has happened. I do this every night before I go to bed. I look at who I've talked to because I write everything down and because I have a big, and I'm home now, so I write everything down as I'm talking to them and I go back and would I want to change something? What was that dialogue like? It's really important because that way you, it's, it's a review and you're really aware of how you are showing up because it's all about energy. So you want to show up in your highest. So thank you for the hearts. Thank you for that, Jill. You know, and, and if anybody would like that book, all you have to do, all you have to do is um, go to my website, angelmarieshines.com and because my other website's not ready yet it's so close lightworkersgifts.com don't go there don't go there it is nothing works on it <laughs> angelmarieshines.com and then go to the book thing and go ahead and invest in yourself and invest in the book and grab it and then every day you can take one and tomorrow i'll be here at nine i believe it's nine again and then on monday and tuesday i'm taking off i've got to take a couple days off and from now on, Monday and Tuesday, I'm taking off. And then I'll be back Wednesday, Thursday with Tai Chi and the Daily Dose. And Lightworkers Unite. Nikki's going to be on tonight. Yay! And Miss Raina was on a couple days ago. I don't remember what day and that Miss Raina was on. And that was a really good show. And she did an activation. Really cool. So go check that out. But I'm going to have to go. So let's put this all together. Because I love you guys. And if you're watching the replay... This is for you, and this is a recap, but it's also a group reading. And, of course, if you want a reading, just call me. Uh, or, or what most people do is message me, and then we'll set up a time. Like I have 
two today and three tomorrow. So thank you. Oh, you're welcome, Miss Raina. You're fabulous. So let's go through this. When you look at children card, when you look at things anew, when you look at them through fresh eyes, not your old eyes, what happens is your truth and integrity. You step into your truth and integrity and you step into forgiving yourself, forgiving others and going from a deeper place of forgiveness on a, a more spiritual, like a really deep level that helps you to be more aware. And when you're more aware, then you can really study self and connect to yourself. Wow. And you really connect to yourself, which goes back to the original card that I started with a half an hour ago, which was that no matter what happens, you will sh truly shine. That's what I love this, where you will truly shine when you promise and you come from your truth. Because that's the ultimate promise to yourself is that fulfillment. And also that nothing can get in your way. Nothing. And that's for me. If I can't figure something out, I will be on the phone with the support team. I will call people. I will. That's why it's in my song. Ask for what you want. Show them what you got. Never give up. Go all the way to the top because when you do not let anyone get in your way, and this is on love though, with love, you will be a force and you are a force because you know how to what? Change your mindset, energize your life and shine on. Change your mindset of how things are, not the why, 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 why can we stuck in that and then come from changing your and energizing your life meaning you're coming from your heart and you're stepping into it and you're energizing it with love and you're saying okay let's look at how do i get this now why isn't it working right so you are so welcome reina nikki jody jill i'm so happy that you were here today because then i would just be talking to myself <laughs> so have a fabulous day and nikki i'll see you tonight or this morning for you at three in the morning so get some sleep. Love you. Love everybody. And remember, you really matter. And if you haven't already, go to the Shine On Movement page. It's a group, public group page. And like the page and you already there because you're a light worker. Remember, you are divinely protected. Divinely protected. Divinely protected all the way through. Bye, guys. Have a great day. Because you can. You really can. Choose it. Be it. Shine on, shine on, shine on, shine on.